Yes, I said it. Do you know the meaning of faces? What is what the noble practicing in Lagos? Can you call it democracy? Lagos APC, are they practicing democracy? Lagos APC, are they practicing democracy? Lagos APC, let's take Lagos APC as a case study. Are they practicing democracy in Lagos states? Are they practicing democracy? <laughs> wahala, wahala, wahala. Eh? Huh? go resto. Everybody, bus, 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 bus. So, will you think Wole Soinka, right? If I'm correct, came out the other day and started abusing the obedient movement. I refuse to make that video because to me it is unnecessary. An elder who is shameless and has refused to know that he is an elder. Of course, you see why I tell you that social media. Do you know that obedient went and dug, dug out video of 2007, I mean 2001, when Bola Tinubu was still the president of Lagos? They dug out when he was a beneficiary of Tinubu's government. <laughs> Wahala. This Yoruba man, I don't come out now. We don't carry Wolo Soinka for her though. He want to explain to Wolo Inka, Wolo Soinka, I don't know that's name, Wolo Soinka that, you see, everything you are doing shows that even the little respect they still have for you, you just messed it up. What's up ladies and gents? If this is your first time of coming across the tank right don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, don't forget to follow. Most importantly, like our videos because according to YouTube and Facebook policy, the more you like our videos, the more the help recommended to other subscribers you have not yet subscribed to this channel. God bless you and bless you massively. In turn, for what we have been doing, there is a greater privilege of what we share, what we do, how we do the things we do, and the place we are heading and that shows so much victory in everything that the obedience movement have been doing the light is shining already bola ahmed tinubu has not come back to you know defend himself in court after i wonder after he rigged the election and selected himself as the president of nigeria by force by law what then happened? He flew to whatever country that he is to treat himself so that on that day he will come and accept the, the you know, he, 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 he is a selfish man. He's a very selfish man that can do anything for money, for power, for fame, anything that needs to be done. So I would like you to listen to this man. It's a very long video, but take your time, be patient and listen to him. You're going to learn a lot. I don't have much things to say. I would have given credit to him, but his handle wasn't there. But I love what this Yoruba man said. Listen and be blessed. Peace out. I said it. Do you know the meaning of faces? What is what the noble practice in Lagos? Can you call it democracy? Lagos APC, are they practicing democracy? Lagos APC, are they practicing democracy? Lagos APC, let's take Lagos APC as a case study. Are they practicing democracy in Lagos days? Are they practicing democracy in Lagos? Are they practicing democracy? Are they practicing? Please give me a minute. Hello? Are you rooted in Jesus? Yes. Yes. Oh, no, no problem. No, everything is okay. Happy Easter. Okay, she has been. Are they, are they practicing democracy in Lagos State? I just say obese supporters are faces. If, if you don't know the meaning of faces, I will tell you. Is the noble practicing democracy from 1999 up to date? Can you say to know you are a Democrat? To know your bosom friend? Can you say he's a Democrat? Look at Lagos State. Look at Lagos State since 1999. How did Lagos State governors emerge? How did Lagos State governors emerge? 
Can you say, Professor Joishka, I'm asking you the question, so, and I want you to write me a letter. Because if you insult me, Professor Joishka, I will insult you back. If you insult me back with your letter, I will insult you back. And uh, to God will make me. They are not special, but more than anybody. So, can you say your friend, Tinubu, has been practicing democracy in Lagos State since 1999? Let's go back to 1999, since 1990 to date. How are governors in Lagos State emerged? Can you say governors in Lagos State emerged in a democratic process? Can you say senators, House of Rep members, House of Assembly members, emerged in Lagos State through a democratic process? See, the people will just sit down in body law and select them. And select them. Let me, uh, quote, quote me. To the people we mad, we sit down in the, in the corner of his bedroom in Lagos State and select senators. Select, select House of Rep members. Select House of Assembly members up to local government councillors just because you want to control Lagos State APC. And then you come out and be say, calling some people faces. And then if they are faces, who are you to tell them? So what do you want to do, Professor Shinka? So because they are faces, what, what, what do you want to do? You want to shut them for reasonable felony or what? Or, I, I, I was even expecting you to write a letter to Malami to shut them. If you don't want Ibos to become president, it's as simple as ABC, let Ibos go. If you don't want, if you think Ibos are not qualified to be president of Nigeria, let them go, let them have Biafra. It's as simple as ABC. If you think Ibos are not worthy to be president of Nigeria, let them go. Let them go and form Biafra. It's as simple as ABC. If your man wants to be uh, slave to Filani, let them be with the Filanese. Let Ibos go and form Biafra. If you think Ibos are not worthy to become president of Nigeria for some reason that is better known to you, the elders, let Ibos go and form their own country. What happened in that country does not concern you again. But you cannot, you cannot just lump everybody together and then one particular tribe will be the president perpetually, others will be slaves. You cannot be collecting taxes from Igbo people and tell Igbo people that they are not worthy to be president of Nigeria. You cannot be exploiting minerals from Igbo land and you are telling Igbo they are not worthy to be president of Nigeria. It doesn't work like that. Go and look at history of America. America became independent in 1776, July 4th, by virtue of taxation. The team was no taxation without representation. The team of American president, uh, of American independence, no taxation without representation. They were paying taxes to UK, United Kingdom, and they don't have anybody representing them in the House of Commons in UK. And they said, look, we cannot be paying taxes to you without having a representative in the House of Commons. And that's how America got independence, if people don't know. July 4th, 1776. So, I, 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 what, 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 Professor Fajika, if you're a beneficiary of Tinubu, that's between you and Tinubu. Don't come and be confusing us with BB Grammar. And that is not shameful for anybody who is supporting Tinubu, and you cannot come out openly that you are supporting Tinubu. It's, a, it's, a, it's an act, act of cowardice for you to be supporting Tinubu in the, after, in, in, in the night. And then in the afternoon, you'll be telling people that you are neutral, you are for the masses. It's an act of cowardice for you to be a supporter of Tinubu and you're hiding under, the, under your bed. You can't even come up boldly to say, I'm supporting Tinubu. So, I, I'm not supporting Tinubu. And I can say that anytime, anytime anywhere, anytime. So, if anybody, whoever your position in Nigeria, you are supporting Tinubu and you cannot come up boldly and say Tinubu is my candidate. That is, shame on you. Shame on you. I'm going to play you a video now. You cannot be calling yourself elders, elders, and then you are perpetrating injustice and you are calling yourself elders. What kind of elders are that? Are you? Elders that cannot say the truth. And I'm expecting to come and join the show again.
So you are not the only one that can speak English. So please, presentation, I'm expecting you. I'm waiting for a reply. Forget about the age. This is not an age issue. This is a fact. This is a statement of fact. I'm expecting your rejoined that. I've written a letter to you, and I'm I'm doing this program. And if I want to sue me for libel, let's sue me for libel and let's meet in court. That's how they destroy the jail completely. The so called elders. All of you enjoy free education. Professor, you can't go. You enjoy free education and you destroy the country. If it, look, go, go, go to section 40 of the national constitution. Go to section 40. And if you don't know, let me tell you, Prof. Go to section 40 of the national constitution. Go to section 39, subsection 1. Everybody, by version of section 40, you have any right to join any party in Nigeria. You have any right. So if 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 Ibos decide that all of them will join Labour Party, so be it. If Ibos decide, okay, we want to be in Labour Party, we, we know that Labour Party will serve our interest, we protect. There's nothing wrong with it by virtue of Section 40, 1999 Constitution. 